Hello everybody, Bytech here and welcome to my new video. The Galaxy S7 and S7 Edge have been fantastic camera phones in the year 2017. Wouldn't it be awesome if you could make it better? Well now in 2018 let me show you how you can do that by getting the portrait mode feature that is popular in the Pixel 2 phones. Step 1. Download the file from the link in the description and install the same. While you try to install the downloaded file, it may ask you to allow installation from unknown sources. You will need to allow that so that the installation can be successful. Once installed, open the camera app and it looks like this icon here that you see on the screen right now. Once you open it, it will ask you for a few permissions which you need to allow. So let's allow that and you see that the app launches successfully. So here, if I go into the hamburger menu on the top left, you see that we have the option of lens blur, but not the option for portrait mode. To enable portrait mode, you just need to tweak a few settings in this app. So let me show you what you need to change. So click on the settings option here, then go to BSG mod settings. The model by default will be Pixel XL. Change that to Nexus 6. Once that's done, scroll down a bit on this page and change the final JPG quality HDR plus from 95%. Let's change that to 100% so that we get the best results. Next, you just need to ensure that portrait mode on all models is enabled. Please note that this portrait mode feature will only work on the back camera. Once you enable this here, it is necessary to completely close the application and the changes will take effect at the next start. So let's go ahead and get out of the settings menu and back to the camera application. You can see it's all black now. Let's close this out here and relaunch the camera. And now you will see that the portrait mode has been enabled. So let's quickly check if it actually works. So since only the rare camera has this feature, let me take a quick photograph of myself using the rear camera. Okay, now let's see if the portrait mode actually works. So, looks like it did. So if you see here, this is the normal photo and this is the portrait mode photo. So you can easily see the difference in the background. The portrait mode, the background is blurred out, whereas the background is clear in the normal mode. So when you take a photo on the portrait mode, just like a Pixel phone, two photos are captured for you and you can check which one suits you better. You can either keep the portrait mode effect uh, and delete the other file or vice versa. So the choice is completely yours. So one quick thing that I have noticed uh, here is I've taken quite a few uh, test photographs using this mode and it works brilliantly when you take portraits of people but it does not work that well with portraits of objects as of now. So in future, if there is an update and uh, it works better on objects as well, I will keep you posted on that. But for now, this works best for portrait modes with people. So like I told you, the portrait mode for a selfie doesn't work. So if you can see here, we are in the portrait mode for selfie. And if I try to click a photo, it doesn't really work. However, the normal front facing uh, camera or the selfie camera should work uh, if you get a force close that's okay just relaunch the camera and this should work in the normal mode like you can see so this was a quick video on how to get the portrait mode feature on the s7 if you liked what you saw please click on like and subscribe to my channel also do click on the bell icon to get notified about my future videos because i keep making videos like this Thank you for watching and have a great day.